situation only I am capable of. It was oh, the... It's fine. <laughs> no, I, I, yeah, Fanny, I just said that. I, I, I mean, yeah, I'm a new player. Well, I mean, I'm, I am a new player, but, you know, I didn't know it. It took me until, like, I think, uh, the, uh, the birthday, the birthday, uh, dungeon. Birthday dungeon? Oh, we did a birthday dungeon. How many times? Uh, Wait, that was, was like the first time the prob- birthday or your fifth, tenth, eleventh. If it makes you feel Pix better, is, this is you. Pix's first campaign, and I apologize because yeah. of the bullshit. Like the birthday campaign, the birthday. Oh, I honestly don't mind. Yeah. Okay, it's a fantasy. Um, if it makes you feel better, when I started playing. Um, I had for I had not known about the strength or dex. Uh, they don't. So they I, don't. They don't make it that clear on the weapons table. Oh they, no, they don't make it clear at all. Like that's understandable. Like if you had forgotten, I just thought uh, by the amount of times we've actually been hitting people, <laughs> that at some point it would have kind of showed up or could have clicked that. Maybe these people are adding more than they're letting on. I had to learn it that way anyways. When I, everyone was born, like, Okay, so the, the DM I was initially planning things with, they had a specific app they used for their sheets, which I disliked. But I, but I was told to copy things down from it. So it was. And, and then I saw, you know, two... I saw with my weapons a, a couple of mysterious pluses with it. And I was like, hey, hey DM, well, what are these pluses for? And they were like, oh, that's your that's your modifiers base. That's also modifiers based on your dex and strength. The, I, I, I had to process that. I had to Windows error screen for a second. Fancy. Fancy. <laughs> <laughs> At least you now know, and let's always get that clear. You now know, and that's a pretty good thing. Um, it's just uh, you get to hit things better now. If okay, well, with the dolly, oh, that, that's with the dolly. How, that's how long? Nice, uh, how long has it been? A year? A year? Two years? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, no Nobody this, wondered but... why I couldn't do, why I couldn't hit so well. No, we just thought your stats were shit. <laughs> and no right, that, stats that's how shit. I felt for the longest time. I, I felt that I was just like dead weight for my group. <laughs> I I that I was under the impression that Velveteen's stat or like everyone's stat like your character's stats are in the same with a new one that they're downright garbage, so you wouldn't be doing a lot. Uh or at least that no. <laughs> Didn't no, no. Me. because <laughs> look. So no, 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 no. Here's the. Do thing. you know that you can add your spell, uh, your spell casting mod to your attack to do extra damage if you're allowed? Hold on, please tell me you know that. What? Oh, <laughs> oh. my god! <laughs> that's why. That's why Bean hasn't been doing much damage in combat. Oh no, fantasy! I thought you were going to do it when you cast Great Flame Blade or some shit! No, it no. specifies in the spell if you can add your spellcasting modifier. And you can. Oh, okay. Please tell me that you have the ability to add, like, your ranged spell attack or mel- melee spell attack stuff? Oh my gosh. Okay, fantasy, we're gonna have to... Oh, we're gonna do a whole of the Man, thing. I... Today is going to be a slow session. Woo! I, I don't know a single thing you guys are talking about. Okay, so we're gonna start the session off. It's gonna be a slow session because not a lot of people are here. Looking at Adelia's sheet. I, I joked <laughs> the fray. No, I'm joking. Okay, fantasy, 
I now I know this. Beer, that's fine. I don't care. I'm go- okay. Fantasy. I you need to send me. You need to send me bean sheet. I need to see it and know <laughs> what is going on. Because what is going on, with the live scene? What is going because, on in that head? Because I do not. This was so. That's painful to hear. Okay. Not because like it's bad for you. I'm just saying that like knowing that it's been this long, a year or two, and you, and you haven't didn't, asked. And, and you haven't asked, or you had because we didn't know, because we thought like it because we thought of a whole bunch of reasons why this happened. We don't think like the players forgot that this was a thing. We think like either oh maybe it like bad stats, or uh, maybe um that was like that's like one of the main things. Like okay, so or the maybe stats the dice was rolling bad that day. Or... Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. Was... <laughs> so, please tell me you know what a spell at- attack modifier is. I know what that is. Okay. Proficiency plus your spellcasting mod. Mm-hmm. And I know that you know your spell save DC. Mm-hmm. Okay. Your spell attack modifier can be added to your melee hit or your range spell attack so that you can do so you actually hit. Because you're Wait, doing I think... damn it. Wait, hold on. Maybe. Yeah. Wait, I don't think. No. No, 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 no. Not with normal weapon attacks. That doesn't No, no, no. Like I spelled spell attacks. I said spell attacks. Okay. There mm-hmm. are mele- melee spell attacks and there are ranged spell attacks. You Basically, push, push. if you're slapping a bitch or you're sending a slap to someone. Like and vampiric touch. Oh. I thought they were the same thing. They are no. the same thing for the dice. Don't worry about it. The Imagine. attack mod you add to your dice whenever you want to hit something with a spell that isn't an ally, like, you know, Cure Wounds. Cure Wounds, you don't need to do your attack modifier. You just go over there and slap the boy's ass. Don't worry about it. But whenever you, say, want to chuck a baseball-sized hail at somebody's head... That is full of just ice magic because you're just really mad at them for some reason. That's whenever you add your spell attack modifier. Hmm. So it's a d20 plus your spell attack mod, which is your proficiency and your charisma. So you don't have to just continuously add, let's say, plus five, plus two. Stuff like that. Mm-hmm. And I know that you know your spell save DC. Mm-hmm. Now, think um, your spell attack modifier, but for your regular weapons. Yeah, my re- regular weapons. Okay, so your spell attack modifier. Mm-hmm. Instead of your casting mod, which, since you're a bard in this game, it would be charisma, you would think of your damage mod. Like, since you're doing a rapier, it could be either strength or dex. Because you have a versatile. Mm-hmm. So it is proficiency plus damage mod. Now for the actual damage, it is the damage dice plus that damage mod, no proficiency. That's it. Do we need to practice on a tree in game? <laughs> we can do that. Like I, I, I can fully, I, I, we can fully do that. I think just practice on a tree. I so you can process this. All right. How about this? Instead of a tree, Amalon, you notice that Idelia has a lot on her mind. <laughs> She's suddenly been given a bunch of responsibility with a kid, and even though the kid is basically not there right now because she's working because she wants to work wait didn't we like you guys... take her out of the tavern though and get on the road last time did you yeah I, th- I, I thought so okay. You're right you guys were heading to green hall yeah so as you guys so why we rewind time for a bit from that explanation because I was wrong. 
So you guys are out on the road. Thiefling mm-hmm. child is asleep, and the dragon, uh, half dragon, half orc, is honestly causing problems for Shiny because he keeps trying to steal copper. <laughs> And on the wall, you see Idalia looking at her lantern, confused. Or just not on a lawn. What are you calling call What? You notice, on a lawn, you notice Idalia is looking at her lantern, confused. Um... A new lawn would kind of like inch himself a little bit closer uh, to an, uh, a dally and just kind of tap on her shoulders, like, hey, um, y'all right there? Oh, um, I'm all right, I suppose. Just, um, I'm not sure if I'm, if I even know what I'm looking at at this point. Um,. It's a lantern, whatever, with a special flame. No, 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 no. Here, look through it. And Nualon will look through the lantern. Anulon, as soon as you start looking through the lantern, you can see that it looks like the form of the flame is a form of a swordsman. Dancing back and forth, doing sword stances. It looks like someone's doing sword stances. Um, they got a sword. Oh, that uh, doesn't line. Never mind. No, it's con- that's a bit. That wasn't what you saw. While we were fighting that gluttony guy, I looked through it and I was able to see him. So the lantern's got special properties. You know. Like... But I hardly knew my teacher is anything absolutely special. Of course she was a wonderful teacher, but... Who was your teacher? Uh, Dion, do I remember my teacher well enough to recall a name? Roll history. Remember all, everything you can about it, the mods and everything. Please, we beg of you. Oh, no! wow! First roll Wait, of the night. Wait, what? Is this, is this the first roll of the day? That's the first roll of the night. All right. As you start to think about it, oh. it feels like something in your head finally pops. You remember. You remember. A lot more than your teacher. You remember that she was centered in the center of a lake. Her large manor was something on the edge of it. But in the center, there was a small, what looked to be, theater? Orchestra pit? Something strange. That's what you remember. The... Do I remember? She called it something, an amphitheater. There she would practice over and over. With the stillness of the lake in the amphitheater, she taught you how to play. But you notice that she, you know that she would never go into the sunlight. Her pale skin and bright red eyes clashed with her little Lolita, um, way of dressing her black and white laced clothes do i remember her name no but she said that she didn't like her name instead she went by a different title and then it hit you you were the student of the god of remembrance how could you have forgotten (laughs) okay Alamon, you've met this person. Has it been mentioned to me, though? You've met them personally. Ah, I remember now. Wait a minute. Remembrance. Is it that? No, it was not 
from the fucking tower, not the clock place. No. Wait, was it? Oh wait, no. Do you have a? Never mind. I'm mixing yeah. up campaigns. Technically, <laughs> it was Friday campaign before it got changed over because of uh, boredom into the Candyland campaign that met the uh, Goddess of Remembrance. You've met her brother, though. The God of the Mind and Cognition. Madness. Oh, okay. Well, that one, yeah. <laughs> And he has actually talked to you about meeting the Goddess of Remembrance. But only in passing. You've never really met her. How don't that be all? Well, the Goddess of Remembrance was your teacher. You never became a cleric. Because, really, there was no need to be. She never wanted you to be a cleric. She wanted you to be a bard. You had excellent talent. How she put it. Talent for making people see things that aren't there. She gave you the lantern to aid you with this quest. To go and see things that honestly should not be there. Perhaps this is a clue to why you were able to see through water when no one else could. Oh dear. Maybe to get there. Um, there's something clicking in your head. You kind of look like, or at least showing some expression that something's kind of clicking in your head right now. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, something did. You know what? Remembrance. <laughs> Excuse me, what? Remembrance. Um, she didn't like her name, so I think that was a, a shortened version of you. Remembrance, remembrance, remembrance. Yeah, that's clicking for me too. Did she resemble like a um vampire? Um, I remember she wore Lolita clothes. Okay. Um, she was quite pale. Okay. So yes, your teacher was um if um, everything is correct, I'm definitely a uh, teacher worth being a pupil for. And that lantern is very much so not just a lantern. Well, we, well I feel like we had established that by now. Well, yes, but uh, in terms of what you're looking through or what you're looking into, it could have something... Uh, to do with whatever mission or goal she set you upon. You don't just get handed these, thing, these things just as a parting gift. Well, I mean, sometimes, but not all the time. Was there any goal set in mind that you could remember anything? Do I remember? That part of your memory still remains fuzzy, as if something or someone doesn't want you to remember. No, no recollection, recollection, I'm afraid. He uh, places a hand on her shoulder. Same here. Well, kind of. It's all fuzzy still as well. We're on the same boat together. Um, seeing whatever gluttony was, definitely um, set a trigger off. It's definitely, uh, <laughs> it was definitely something. All right, well, we at least know a couple tracks, a couple things. That lantern is more than it leads on, of course, because, I mean, I assume some, not everything kind of just uh, looks like that. So he's going to point just at the burn or the flame, the coloration, um, at least not traditionally. And seeing a swordsman with stances through the fire doesn't happen at all. So, maybe... You said remembrance. Maybe the lantern's got to do with something about that. Seeing things, maybe? Sight? Uh, maybe uh, might have to do with just helping those remember what they have forgotten. 
because I'm going to go on a wild guess. Your teacher was something much more uh, fantastical, uh, if vampiric. You could say that again. Oh, fantastical. Okay. So uh, we'll keep that one in mind. We'll actually keep that as a mental note. Uh, Anulon's going to open up his book. Uh it's just basically just ring, 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 ring. Um, Remembrance, vampire, I think. And gave someone a special lantern. In parentheses, Adalia. Who might this, this teacher be? He's just going to... He's going to write that down in the book. And just be like, All right, whoever answers for us, I'll thank him. Except for Puck. I'll just say Puck. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see. Who the hell answers I mean, I'm switching to my wait, I'm switching to my headphones and we're right. It always gonna look over at the book. And Unfortunately, I... all you see is right, um, Analon's scribbles. You don't see anyone answering back. Ah, uh, that's ah uh, yes, well, the D twelve. I finally get to break those out. Is this another one of those um cleric things you do? Oh. Normally, you don't just have clerics or holy men. Um, just straight talking with their deities. Um, it, this is one of those occasions where it's more common. I've actually talked to a lot of people on this thing, uh, albeit my uh, deity. It's uh, actually the patron. your deity who answers first. Yay! It's Saloon. Oh, wait a minute. It's, huh? It's oh, yeah, Saloon, Saloon yeah. Saloon answers oh, Alun. back. Saloon. Or Luna. Mm -hmm. She goes by many names, remember? Of course. She goes, Ah, I remember. One of my grandchildren. Goddess of Remembrance. Though she was born, and her, her form currently is a vampire. She lives on the, I believe you people say, South eastern side of the continent in a castle named Barnes Castle it's near a large lake that has well a very eerie connotation to it a lot of people get lost there and say that there's an old man that wanders around keeping the, the grounds still pretty even though they are slightly overgrown. Uh, Anulon would write down what was name again. That's the funny thing. I can't remember. Oh. Oh dear. <laughs> I, uh, so this is, uh, this is for everybody then. Okay. Uh, probably her brother would remember, but He's currently busy. Mm -hmm. Um, I thank you very much for the information. Very, very much. He's mm -hmm. gonna write that down. Where the <laughs> fuck nugget is it? Ah, there it is. Well, I... I mean, that wasn't exactly what I was... Yeah. I it, but... What? Oh, shoot, uh, yeah. there goes the dog. <laughs> it's Atticus, actually, just uh, make it some uh, Atticus surreal finally noises. appearing once again after eating all the rations in your bag. You currently have zero rations. Oh, shit. <laughs> Do I have to make this man food? I could just... I'll just spawn some food for him. I'm trying to see if I had written anything about it. Anyway, continue with you guys. I'll be flipping to the book, my book. Mm -hmm. Um, what were you saying, Adalia? Oh. Yeah. Oh, good man. Now I'm back. Welcome, Welcome back. back. Adalia is figuring out how to add her dex modifier to her attacks. You know what? Never mind. I'm not back. I'm actually gonna go for forever. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, Apparently, she just she overlooked finesse. 
like heavily. <laughs> she didn't even. She didn't care. <laughs> well, she did care. She well. Did you care for Furness, or did you just kind of thought it was something and then just left it be? I I thought it was just like for flavor. Oh, uh, Okay. I thought it was just like you you know for like the Jill home rule. I, I... <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Okay. Everything on there has a purpose. In most cases, like when you look at the light feature, it means you could hold two of them in any yeah. on each hand. That's why daggers can be used in two hands. In with two-handed um, weapons, you can only have that one weapon. There's no buckler or anything you can put on it. Heavy is not flavoring as well. Normally, you need a big uh, strength um, to even wield the weapon if it has the heavy uh, feature. Versatile, if you use both hands, it does a bit. It gives you a better, like a bigger damage dice. Um, anything that has a range, normally it will show you two numbers. The first one is where it's just rolled normally. The second number, which will always be bigger, is if you go on like when you get towards that number and beyond, normally uh, any rolls to throw the thing or to shoot something is made with disadvantage. They all have a purpose. I'm actually when you look at the book. Um, like next to it, like once you get start going past the weapons, it'll show you what everything, uh, what all those traits mean. Wait a minute, you never looked at that? No, I just wrote down the weapons, like and like if I was proficient with them, and then the damage type. At least you know now. At least yeah. you know now. That's, all, that's, that's always the thing. At least you know now. Oh gosh, is this, is this episode going to be called the episode where Sarah realizes how much of a noob she is? Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> I mean, at least, you, at least you knew about the spells for the most part. <laughs> no, at least you worked up the courage to ask. Yes. Now go fight a Tarask. I'm gonna fight it right now. <laughs> fight it right now with no magical weapons. No, please. I right need now. it for this. How do I not die? You get you can full you can call in one person, but you had to do a one D one thousand to make sure they can help. Anyways, what did I miss besides uh teaching fantasy the ropes? Again. Um, the Dragon Trail uh, is currently Adalia. trying to kick the ass of uh, Shiny in the back of the cart for the uh, title of the owner of Copper, even though Copper is a sentient being. Idalia is also just basically trying to remember her shit. It seemed like someone's trying to make her not remember yeah, her shit. Oh, uh, uh, wait, hold on. Let, let me change. Let me change real. Uh, Profile pictures real quick because I I hate I hate very fast bear man Why I hate it <laughs> because oh, yo fuck, oh, yeah. yo fuckers made me cope and seethe continuously I fucking do lab work without like hmm fighting and me cannot be able to bet like bro come on at least let me win twenty dollars here on the sidelines for fuck's sakes all right now what I'm gonna do is can I roll a persuasion check because I'm gonna tell the child something what are you going to tell the child and then you can roll you, okay I'm going to tell the child that you shouldn't fight people for ownership over something that is sentient that thing can talk yes he's also part of the he's also part of the group he's not owned by no one now While that's going on, what's my little what's my little tiefling girl up to? She's still taking a nap. She gets tired on long carriage rides. Oh. Which because because like, mood. Does, does she have like a blanket blanket over her or something? She does. All right, I, I'm just like tuck the blanket around her a little more. 
the half dragon, half orc will crawl back up to next to next to Alexander and sit beside him, even though it is blizzard o'clock. Blizzard o'clock. It is blizzard o'clock. Uh, can I make a perception check real quick sure. to see who's cold? All right. I shouldn't have said that because my rolls suck. Anyways, uh, fucking. Hold on, I need... hold on. Do I? What the fuck? That per... perception. Hold on. Alex. Alex. The water. 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 Perception check. Perception. Yeah. Fucking wait. <laughs> fucking wait. I'm pulling out my paper. <laughs> okay, perception. Oh Hell yeah. Oh A one. God. Oh, can I? Can, I mean, hey, that's a that's an eleven. I mean, does it, that can do some. Who looks somewhat cold? You. From that eleven. Everyone huh? else is inside the co the covered cart. They have ah. the warmth of the lantern and the warmth of their body heat continuously popping <laughs> off because of radiation. Ah. Radiating heat and all that jazz. I, I guess I just. I don't know, just pull up my scarf higher and then just like see if I can just use like uh, just use it to like as a weird hoodie just to cover my face and then just keep on going. Yeah. It's not don't too far until you guys finally see Green Hall. Oh! Hello! Shiny! Finally, everyone's here. Hey, yo. Hello. Hello. Um, I am still working on my homework. I just am working on something that doesn't require my entire brain. Understandable. Have a nice day. Do drugs. Do not uh, do drugs. I'm gonna do the drug from Limitless that allows me to use 100% of my brain. You already use 100% of your brain. I'm just gonna do this. I wanna do the spice no, from he has. He has not. I can confirm on that. You want to do what you now? Joke. You get my joke. Yeah. Actually, oh. do any of you actually have you have any of you seen Limitless? Yes. It was NCT. No. NCT was destroyed, but um, it's good. Not the movie, the um, the TV show. Oh, I haven't I haven't watched any of the TV show. But on one, what did you say? Oh, I just said no. No, oh, it's it's not. It, it's good. I I recommend it. Let's see. Green Hall. How does Green Hall look? Covered in snow. It's like a, mama. it's it's a university. It's why a the university school town? Why 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 is Al uh Anulan's mother a university? What? What? I don't know. I was just replying to. You. <laughs> I I don't know, man. My brain is just dead from just looking at a fucking microscope. Yeah. Oh. Well, no one wants to try some. He's gonna ask for a dahlia for permission. A dahlia. There we go. Uh, yes. May I use your flame to light the kid this candle? He pulls out a candle. Oh um. All right. Adelia's gonna open the little door on her lantern and let Nuan do that. Nuan's just gonna put his uh the candle at least like uh where it would should burn uh near the flame, see if it catches on or not. A fire is not caught on the candle. This flame does not give off any heat. But like Nuan's you know, just kind of like damn, and he's just gonna use a cantrip uh. It was. Use, like, he's gonna use press digitation. Well, seeing as like uh, the lantern didn't work, he just like oh okay, he uses press digitation to uh, to light the candle. All right. I will right, we'll just touch things. Then. So your thing does not actually act like a flame, but is one. At least I think so. Sounds like mm -hmm. someone doesn't have any bitches. Is that what Shiny says? 
Is that what Shiny says? <laughs> that's a different voice. I don't think that's what Shiny says. <laughs> it's mystery. That's not the voice. That might be Connor's voice. Who the, 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 the fuck is like this? Why, why, is, why is Shiny 20 why is Shiny twenty years old now? What the fuck happened to the child? What happened to the child? Yeah, no bitches. I have a hair. Let me shut the fuck up. <laughs> he had <misses. laughs> Alright, Green Hall and all its green glory and university glory, I guess. The town is rather chilly. It blocks a lot of the wind, but the snow drifts are ridiculous. You see the um, himbo boys. Clearing the snow as best as they can. Why did my shit autocorrect the Jumbo? <laughs> I don't know. The Jumbo Boys. <laughs> the Jumbo Boys. The j hey, Jumbo. I can't do it. Alright. Boom. There we go. Oh, shit. Oh, yes, yeah, I need to check a spell. Good. Ah, oh, man, it doesn't affect. Would you... I know the spell, Mold Earth, says portion <coughs> of dirt or stone, but would you also rule snow? Uh, no, because that's water. What, what are you trying to do? Mold Earth. It's basically uh, like yeah, no, if I. That's water. Okay, okay. I just want to. You can do control water on it. Oh, shit, at least. But I don't have that, sadly. I mean, you could do create or destroy water. That is an option. That's what they were doing up in uh, uh, Water Gate. Oh, shit, at least. Oh, wait, did I just scan it? that dumb? <laughs> I just scanned it. Oh, thank God. Okay. I am that stupid. Can confirm. Yeah, I mean, I wanted to keep quiet for a little <laughs> bit longer. <laughs> we didn't want to admit it. But... Shit. Two of you have missions in this town. Oh fuck! Wait, am I finally getting my gun? Uh, you guys are level ten. That is true. I gotta. This boy really forgot. I also gotta look back at my shit see if I uh what my uh. I'm finally getting what my ass has to do over here. You're not the one. Well, I mean, I think you also do, but I was actually talking about Alexander. I was trying to keep. Oh, quiet of, I was trying to keep quiet of that DM. Too bad. So sad. It's Out of bad. character, they know. Uh, in character, they don't. Don't worry about it. Yeah. Let's see. Oh. Okay. Well, I thought I did. That's okay. No, you don't. Oh shit. Oh. I I'm know. making. I'm. I'm making sure you're the last person to know. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. We're gonna but go it is a pipe. blizzard outside, and it's getting kind of hard for the horse to stay warm. Where's the nearby stable? Nearby, nearby, nearby is a tavern slash inn that you can go into. Okay, I'm gonna go in, gonna, gonna like, um, what was the terminology again? But like I'm just gonna like go settle down like the set, like the wagon slash shit, and then I'm just gonna go into like the nearby inn, uh, and I'll see if I can just perform in there for a free room. All right. And I, and I'll just say Dahlia if she wants to join in. Yeah, I'll join in. So shiny, on the lawn. Yes. The car has stopped. Um. A new lawn will try to like just kind of like look out to see, um, um, where uh, like where exactly are we in? We know we're in Green Hall, but just kind of like what's nearby. 
It's the end that you guys used. Ice is crunchy. Crunch. <laughs> Nate. Nulon, uh. Which is just quickly like look over everything, I guess, in the card first. Make sure nothing go went missing. Uh if there is anything that could have went missing. The tiefling girl wakes up. Uh why are we oh, where are we? Is she asking someone else or she's kinda of waking oh. up. So it's a general where are we? The it might half the half orc, half dragon kid goes outside and goes, Oh, yes, no! I'm gonna write my name in it! She. <laughs> uh, am I there to answer the Tiefling yes. Girl's question? Or am I? Oh, we're in Green Hollow. Green Hollow? I don't know where <laughs> that is. Uh, I just, as mention of that, I'll just pull out the map, the Alice of Stars, and just like, okay. And just like show it to the kid. Uh, so basically, you went from like you see this like lower part of the map. Now you're up here. Whoa. Oh, oh, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna give the I'm gonna give the little girl pats. She kind of wraps I... herself in the blanket. You see the uh, the orc dragon boy, half dragon, quickly poke its head around the cart. Hey, Dad! Guess what? I wrote my name in the snow. I I die a little from hearing that, <laughs> but I th but I'll just say like that. <clears throat> that that's nice. Uh, me and uh, th me and my uh, com and Idalia here are gonna go perform for your room. So uh, stay there for a little, okay? Or you can go inside and watch me. I'm gonna and go inside. You... It's cold as balls out here. And I, I guess I just, I like open the door for the kid so we can go in, for the both of them. I'm gonna what look towards the little girl. I'm doing? gonna look towards the. I'd like to look towards the little girl and go. Do you want to watch me perform? She's going to nod. All right, you, you can come watch, and maybe okay. you'll get to dance a little. Uh, uh, okay. <laughs> She'll follow you out of the cart and into the tavern. Adalon, shiny. What the heck is going on? Uh, Shiny's, uh, at the moment, uh, well, actually, Sonoda's, I think he's gonna get something, uh, so he's out for now. And Nulan will actually kind of just, uh, he's got no business going into a tavern at the moment, so at the moment, so right now he's just gonna stay in the car, just kind of keep watch of anything. Uh, not really much, like, out of fear, just kind of like, uh, he doesn't really want to be in a tavern right now. He's not feeling it. So we'll just, like, kind of, uh, be out in the car. Kind of just looking around, uh, the activities, anything anyone's doing outside, if there is anyone out or anyone noticeable, I guess. Um, that's really much. Uh, that's really much all he's doing. There's no one outside in the blizzard, other other than the himbos. <laughs> the himbos. You always gotta watch out for the himbos, though. They got some. They got something going on. Yeah, they're currently trying to keep the snow off the road. Exactly. Off at the distance, you hear. Uh, I was gonna look and try to find whatever that noise is. It's the himbos. They're pushing large. Oh, it's snow it's just <laughs> shovels. It's just, it's just it's just the himbos making chance. Okay, <laughs> okay. Uh, I guess some Anuan could do the pass on time for himself and just either use press of digitization or thaumaturge or anything just to kind of make, uh, like just kind of make like, uh, like small little fireworks or sparkle just kind of come out of his hands. Uh, would you really like to go it. into the tavern and do that? Or would you, uh, are you staying out in the cart or the <laughs> stable area? He's staying out in the, he's staying out in the car. He's just doing this to himself. Just for his own entertainment. Okay, it's gonna get cold though. <sighs> oh, fine. You know, no, you know what? No, no. Kai wants to play this game. Oh. Fine. I, 
Uh, do, do I notice that Anolan is not with inside the tavern? Uh, for a while, yes. You notice that the edgy lord of the harem is not in the he tavern. Just wants to stay I just go, or uh, I for a brief second, it's I just. It's a blizzard outside, Anolan! Okay. For a brief second, I just go outside and I just slap Anolan in the forehead and give him a warm shield and then walk out. In. I walk back in. Okay, well, why should you walk back in? Just thank you, I guess. Yeah, thank you. And now... Who wants uh, to be outside? Just... And now who wants to be outside? <laughs> Finish! You go, I'm sorry. No, you go. You go, for fuck's no, sake. You go, you go. You go, for All right. you go. Now do I roll for performance? Yes. Okay. With advantage or no? Yes. All right. Wait, what were my modifiers again? I'm level 10, I forgot. Sorcerer, 5e, I'm throw. Oh my god, I'm so. I'm... No, like, my total modifiers because he who. Uh, you don't have the... that written down? No, like, it scales on levels, that's what I meant, so I don't know, like, if there's an additional one or not. Alright, uh -huh. still it's still the same. That's that's what I was checking. Alright, so. Dun, dun, dun. Da dun. Bong. Oh. It has a loaded. Ah. At thirty-two. Y yeah, that works. <laughs> that is pretty good. Yeah. And I just go walk outside again until Anolan. Okay, your room's done. You oh, get okay. three rooms done and a honorary uh, stable master will go and clean and trim your horse's hooves for you. Uh, I just uh, go... Wait, who was the person again? What was it called again? Stable master? Okay, so uh, I just give the stable master uh, one extra gold coin and I just say... Uh, can you watch the wagon for us? I'm gonna go head out. The old man, who is honestly underdressed for his position, gives you a thumbs up. I just chip him the gold coin, and I'm just gonna go walk towards the... Uh, what was the name of that fucking building? I'm just gonna go to the temple, or the time goddess. All right. It's a little harder to get there because of the snow, but you do find your way to the Temple of the Time Goddess. Okay. And then Alexander's just gonna take... Well, was it a ring or was it a coin? I it don't... Was a, it, it was a pocket watch. Wait, was it a pocket? Oh, yeah, stop, stopwatch. Like, okay, pocket mm -hmm. watch. I just take out the pocket watch in front of the statue and I just, like... So, do I just show you this, or is there, like, a way I can interact with you? I, it, the it's statue sound. is silent. For this time, there is no cleric to give you any further instruction. Hmm. Sorry, I had to think of the word, and I was just like, Ugh! Und Understandable. Uh, I just, I guess I just look around to see if, like, there's any like, uh, buttons or anything I can, like, interact with. There seems to be a small hole in the Warforge's chest. Or the statue's chest. I guess I'll I guess I'll just look into the hole and see what I can see from the other side, I guess? There is no other side, but it does look like if you put the pocket watch into the hole, it will completely fill. I guess I'll just proceed to do that then. As soon as you do, the hands start to move. This time, at the normal rate. You hear the soft ticking, and you see the statue move. Anlon, for the first time in a while, you get a different ringtone. All right, and one will answer it as it's uh, new people. He's just like, he opens up the book. The ringtone is Hickory Dickory Dock. 
Okay. Atticus hates that. Atticus is not like that ringtone. <laughs> not one for me. All that is in the book, which is written Wait. in a bronze-like ink, says, Tick tock, harem boy. There's no more time upon the clock. All right, what was that again? Tick tock, harem boy. There's no more time upon the clock. All right. Alexander? In front of you falls an elderly looking man. You have freed your grandfather from Puck's curse. I I just, it, as soon as I see him, I just instantly run up and hug him and, and fall down to my knees. The man looks cold, but Dude, he is still alive. Give me a charisma and give me a dexterity seven. I'm joking. <laughs> anyways, I'm not gonna do that too shiny just yet. But anyways, I'm just gonna like, um, I'm just gonna cast warm shield and just see, uh, uh, uh Grant Harrison. All right, are you okay? <laughs> Kid, is that you? Oh, yeah. God. What what year is it? It kind of looks around. Uh, oh, is it so the year cold? is 1971. What are we told about the year, Kai? <laughs> it's the 19... Oh, gosh. When was the Industrial Revolution? Uh, nine, the Industrial Revolution started around the late of the 18th century, starting to the 19th century, and ended around the upper ends of the 20th century, where we just decided to go, do you know what? Fuck it. Thank you. Ah, okay. In human years, if we go around that in, <laughs> if you are outside the portal, it is 1901. Inside Muestra, it is 14,620. 4,000. 14,000. Yeah, okay, yeah. Where's 14,000? And that yeah. is only because the dwarves were here first. And they kept time on every day. Nice. I just, uh,. I saw, uh, it's the, it's, it's the 14, 1400s, uh, grandpa. He kind of sits up and rubs his face very weirdly and looks at you and he, he looks no older than the time that you saw him, you know, back in Red Vuitton when he drank perfume. I. <sighs> Do you remember anything at all? He quickly h hugs you and holds you tight. Alexander, it's been not even that long since I last saw you. Yeah. I. I know. It's. It's so bad. Mother's dead. And uh, sister's alive, at least, but... He keeps I don't... hugging you. And he pats your back. And you're, and you're still alive, too. Don't count yourself out just yet. I don't know if I'm alive anymore. I'm just surviving. I... I... <sighs> I he brought more. your bread. face, Miha. He's Polish. He's Polish. What? What's the Polish word for child? Yikes. <laughs> if I could. I have to do. Skietzko. 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 Schizo. Hold on, give me a minute. Give me a minute. <laughs> I don't know what pronunciation it is, 
Skietsko? Skietsko. Skietsko. Yeah. Okay. Harder in the back of the throat. Gotcha. Skietsko. That's probably not even the correct pronunciation, but I don't give a fuck at this point. It, it just roll with the tongue. Go. Skietsko. Look at me. <sighs> you are alive, and you brought me home. I brought you home, but I also brought so many dead people along with it, too. I... I don't know anymore if I am fit to be an adventurer. I, I, I try my best to make, you know, to at least help people, but every time I do, I just end up hurting, and in the end, I just don't know. I just wish Mother was here. He hugs you tight again. I wish so as well. I was not there whenever she died. But I know the bastard who did it. I know too. I... Chaos. I don't have enough power to deal with them myself. And that's why you have me. Well... You're not yeah. alone anymore. You never were. I, n I never was. It's just that all these problems I've been caused it were because of me. No. And... No, they weren't. In fact, most of them were because you were related to me. He it's... caused you hell because he, his blasted father, couldn't keep his war off of our soil. Yeah, but I'm still being played like a pawn, and I even get repercussions for being it. I don't have enough power to deal with them alone. I wish I did, but sadly I can't. And now, <sighs> I, I'm trying to pay back everything I have done to the world. Why? <sighs> pay back the world? Sure. A noble excuse. But. You have more power in you. Thanks to my blood. Than you think. That power would have been really useful for me to stop all this carnage then. To stop you me from being brainwashed by his associates. And injuring a lot of people. It would have helped a lot to stop uh, Repetons being water poisoned, but I get what you're going for. We're dragons after all. You have a lot more responsibility, thanks to your dragon blood. But there is one dragon who honestly is an asshole and you could learn from. I wonder if that bastard of a child is still alive. The King of the North. Is that what he is calling himself now? Oh, Yes. God. He's calling himself Yo Mama. No, please. Not another one. I'm Sonny, already adopted my... It's too cold for you to do that. Get inside I... the tavern before you start talking to me again. No. <laughs> Make me. Alright, give me a Christmas save. Roll con save, <laughs> dickweeb. <laughs> Alright. Come on, save it is. Oh, where's my con? Nat 1, Nat 1, Nat 1, Nat 1. Even if it's a Nat 1, it's not gonna be that bad. It won't, Are but it will. Are you sure about that? But it's still weak. Oh. You my gamer. It's cold, you... but you always have one level of exhaustion on you. Meh. I go back inside. Alright. Understandable. You're cold blooded, remember? I know. Go inside I the did. tavern! Go next to the I furnace! Am. Okay! Amy. Back over to Alexander. Just because you have a lot of responsibility doesn't mean that you and don't. Why she got away? 
What? Te voy a... ¡Ve a tu cuarto! ¡Ve! Oh. ¡Ve! ¡No! RIP! Oh, so... <laughs> I caught like a little bit of that because I've had like conversational Spanish put into me from college a couple of years ago, but that's all I could catch like two, maybe three words. Kids fucking off. That's basically it. Ah, uh, gotcha. Okay. Back over to Alexander. Wait, we can't do well, that. Back over to Avalon. You got uh, a so new person just got... contacting you. And basically just said TikTok just got cooked by board. his god. No, it's not his god. Yeah. TikTok harem boy, there's no more time on the clock. So that's what was written? Yes. Alright, well, very cryptic. Very much TikTok, so. TikTok, I hate that app. <laughs> oh, stop. <laughs> oh, fuck. Also, uh, you see a second one. You see Puck right very quickly. How the hell did you get out of your seal? Uh -huh. The bronze writing, would it have any sort of familiarity to a new law? Even Sorry. if it's very faint or uh, if it was Has Avalon ever gone recent. to the time, the time church? Yes. He, he oh, has the time dimension. He has, but he, more as in interacting with a cleric more instead of the goddess. He was trying to yeah. spit game. Yeah, you were trying to spit game. There's um. Some... Also, sorry about that. Uh, but fighting a someone that's almost a foot taller than you does. It, it is a struggle. <laughs> I'm pulling out my shoe. Hold on, just in case. Just in case. Like and, and, and anyways, <laughs> continue, <laughs> continuing on. Anilon. Oh, sorry. We moved over to Anilon. He, he got, uh, he got hit with the time goddess and Puck basically writing quickly. How the hell did you get out of your seal? Oh shit. Where's the popcorn? Uh, no, a Wait, new so he was in an animal? Why was he in an animal? All right. Seal. Even a seal? That's kind of yikes. Are you what are you going to are you going to watch or are you gonna write? Uh a new lawn will write How do I know you'd be involved with this fucking puck? I sealed her so you could have more time. <laughs> what? Oh, sorry. I just got a message. Um. <laughs> Did you get a message from Dude? No, I don't know what you're talking about. Mm. All right. Mm, sure. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> a new will write. Uh, first of all, uh, jokingly, first of all. Uh, world star. Secondly, <laughs> secondly, I hear the pings of the Discord. <laughs> secondly, um, he he started to take notice of uh, that. Well, this is a bad more than it is a good. Uh, seeing as time, if it's running out, is is bad. Um. <laughs> So he's a little worried to say the least. Um he's going to write time for what? Puck just gives a an ellipses. And the time and the bronze writing writes back. Time to prepare. Honestly, I didn't think you would get this far, but one of your friends has returned my heart. Oh, Things will go a little so that's what's happening. Faster now. 
I didn't think I'd make it this far either, but I mean, hey, thank you very much for the compliment. I won't take it as a compliment anyway. So Loon just um, comes back and uh, she goes, excuse you, that's my cleric, you path back off. <laughs> that's uh, very nice. Well, Anulon, now knowing that, uh, well, time is right now. Wait a minute, friend, bronze thing, time. Where is Alexander? Like when Anulon looks out, uh, or Alex sees Anulon's gonna go into the tavern, is Alexander at the tavern? You see Alexander come off stage and talk to the. Hold on, give me a second, I gotta sneeze. Bless you. Ow, headache. Ow. Ow. Okay. You see him disappear into the crowd. You don't see him much anymore. And you don't see Shiny. Oh, dear. Um, is Adalia there? Adalia is there, yeah. She and the um, little druid girl start a dance. Should I, should I roll for balance or anything? Nah, I'll just let it slide. Okay. Anulon will go to Adalia. <laughs> Adalia. Natalia, <laughs> I know a lot is like tapping on her shoulder, a little bit more uh, worried. The, the expression is now seen on his face. Tell me, where's where's Shiny? Where's Alexander? Where are they? Um, I, th I think Alexander left for somewhere, and I'm not sure where Shiny is. Fuck. Um. A new one will. Damn. Okay, let me look at some real quick. Let me look at a spell. So, uh, it seems we have gotten our rooms for the night. I don't think we'll need to pour more. Is there anything you want to do, well, little one? No, it's because. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm asking. Uh I, I, I like thought you asking me. It's nice and warm in here, and the people are pre pretty nice. So, uh, I, I'm kind of hungry. Oh, let's get something to eat then. What would you like, Ulu? I would like fondue or soup. Hmm. What up, both? Ooh. Let's see if Green Hall has both. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna order food for for Uwu and uh, the little one. I, I forgot I, why how I forgot her name. I forgot. Well, so did I. <laughs> My brain is is on school mode right now. So like, fair enough. <coughs> Shit, is this just a bad day for all of us now? Yeah, there is uh, a very cheesy soup. Uh, let's order that for Uwu and what would you like, little one? I, 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 would, I would like anything, really. Let's get three soups, one for each of us. Okay. Alright, three soups. Much, how much do how much does three soups cost? Three cheesy soups. Uh, there'll be three silver, one silver, <laughs> and you get a big bread bowl full of it. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, over back to uh, 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 to Alexander. The lights slowly come back on as you see the cleric with your children peering into the hall. I just instantly teleport over there, grabbing my uh, grandfather by his arm. You're saying, oh, one last thing. Meet your grand grandchildren. 
kind of gets down on his knees and hugs them, weeping. The two orphans that you picked up and, like, put in the church after adopting them are hella confused. Uh, so is the cleric. Um, so, quick introduction. Uh, children, this is my grandfather. And, uh, did the cleric who was taking care of my ch children gave me her name? Or... I think somewhere in the past she did, but I can't yeah. remember. <laughs> she just said she just said called me you know like in a notebook paper and with no like phone or anything so like hold on i've been getting phone numbers yet there's no phones <laughs> how is that gonna work i have a lot of phone numbers how am i gonna call them i have no way to there Anyways. is anachronisms that have been happening for a reason uh, do I need to go buy an iPhone now? What the fuck? No. Don't worry about it. I'll explain later. Okay. Uh, um, caretaker. Um, uh, yeah, this is, this is those, he's part of my family. He's my grandfather. Uh, Harrison Thompson. Uh, I'll be back. Harrison? Oh, oh, no, no. Um, she kind of like pulls you away. So that she doesn't uh, scare the children. Yeah. Going, why? why? Your, your, your grandfather is the dragon god? I just pulled down my scarf and like... I knew you were a part dragon, but I didn't know your... I didn't know your ancestor was THE dragon god! Well, there's uh, quite a few of them, but yeah. Yeah. The it's... dragon god above dragon gods. That's why they basically allowed him to just fuck about. Well, yeah. What's the big issue now? Why is he here? What is gonna happen? Nothing, but the return of the dragon gods mean the path of stars are gonna come back out. Oh. I don't want to be the Western government whenever they figure out that they fucked up. Well, I guess my party will take care of it like every other issue we have had. Oh, no, 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 no. You don't need to worry about that. She kind of like pats your arm. You don't have to worry about that. All adventurers are going to probably try to cra cross that blasted bridge. <sighs> and if he's back... That means either yours or his blood, like maybe like maybe even a drop of it, has enough power to bring it and bring down the barrier that's stopping people from going across the path of stars. Um I do have something else to confess. What? The the king of the north. Asked me for mine. I haven't given it yet. Especially she, goes, she kind of covers her face and goes, Ugh. Oh, joy upon the clock. I don't know if that's a pun or not, but. Uh, that means yeah. he's been preparing. That means he's been sending out his children. That means that yes, we all met. those have been confirmed. <laughs> Yes, we also met one of them, and found a few others. Ah, uh, okay. Is there anything that I can do to, you know, prevent cataclysm, oh, madam? No, we're already on the path of cataclysmic doom. Oh, joy, oh, joy upon the seconds. Ah. Oh. I hope you have your affairs in order, Mr. Adventurer. Aff affairs? You mean like this? Exactly what's gonna happen? Okay. So, hmm. Your children have been learning about this, but I'll give you the abridged version. 
basically, <laughs> if no one goes, no one is able to cross the path of stars and survive, we're all dead. Since it's already happened, someone is alive over there. There's only two teams that once went pa went down the path of stars. One, the Cult of Bone, before they were, you know, evil. And the Church. That's what they called themselves. They called themselves the Catholics. Don't know what the hell that means. It was something in Latin. But everyone that went down the path of stars, which uh, if you don't know what the path of stars are, it is a literal path of light that is only available around one night per year. And since the barrier has been yeah. up, hasn't there's not been any issue. But since the dragon uh, king of the north is trying to put it back down, that means if you don't pass, or if anyone does not pass the path of stars test, we can't reawaken the god of the sun. Te voy. Te voy a tu cuarto. And if we can't awaken the path, if we can't awaken the god of the sun, everything perishes in a ball of black. That one's a little vague, but I think it has something to do with the fact that there's a plague going on. So, so Chad Blood can obviously, uh, open the barrier and let people through. Make sure not to bleed on any, uh, ruins or anything, please. That's the only thing I need to worry about. It's to not make this any worse. Oh, trust me, it's going to get worse, uh... Have you bled on anything that can be used to, uh, transfer it? Like, you've given blood, or you've, uh, just been stuck I, I, by anything, like a needle, perhaps, that you just, I don't know, lost any track of? I guess I just, uh, lift my shirt up and just say, well, I, I was fought before. I did, I was in a fight before, and... Do you recognize all the, any of these scars? She'll look over them and goes, Okay, this is a knife wound, there's a sword wound, there's a blast wound. Uh, doesn't look like you've been pricked by anything. Um, you should be fine. But, uh, has any of your friends taken your blood or anything? Uh... Or do you have, like, a sister or someone that is currently receiving medical care? Uh, she used to be, but apparently she is attending a college down in the, in, uh, Myers. Oh, no. It might not even be you. That's not something you need to worry about. That's something I need to worry about. Don't worry. Oh, joy of... Blessings upon our. Oh. She kind of looks around frantic, running her hands through her hair, even though she doesn't have a lot of it out. She has it up in a ponytail. She goes, Okay, I will send your children to a safer place, as there's a lot of things I have to get done, because if your father's here, that means the seal on my goddess is up. And there's a lot of things to prepare before she descends. Hmm. Okay. Um. Looks like I'm not getting a lot of sleep the next couple of nights. Okay. Uh, one last thing. There is also uh, two more children. One, one is mine, but, so, but there is another one that belongs to someone else. And I was wondering if you can take, if you can, like, see if you can have someone else take care of them since you're obviously going to be busy. Oh, yes, yes. I'm, I'm sending your children off to a another area. Do you happen to know a, uh, a temple of the arcane down in uh, Tulip Guard? Uh, yeah. Actually, I do. 
that's the first one I usually call if I have a chill, uh, have to move a child thanks to an adventure, probably moving or just, you know, them not being safe. I usually send them there. Don't worry. She's a wonderful teacher. Uh, she just shut up, set up shop. Um, but yeah, uh, I need you to bring them here so I can set them on their way whenever the blizzard clears. All right, I'll, I'll do that. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm terribly sorry. I didn't. No. Do not worry. She kind of like just pats you on the shoulder. Do not worry. This is for me to deal with. You don't have to worry about it. You basically save us from closing down because they thought our goddess was a fake. Don't worry about it. I just have to do a ton of things because I'm the archbishop and no one gives a fuck. Okay, fine. Um, I, hold on, give me a second. Uh, do you mind any alcoholic beverages? No. I have ceremonial whiskey that I sip from whenever I want. Go ahead. I, I just punch the ground and I summon my last bottle. I mean, my last keg of ooh of Ura see what sway Ryan? I think you uh, give me a give me a second I, I have the description Oriya see sway it tastes like strawberries yeah there's a reason I picked it <laughs> um I think you'll like this one and you're definitely gonna need it uh Archbishop she Matt. looks up at you hugs the keg and goes I could marry you, but since you're an adventurer and I'm a archbishop, that's not allowed. But I mean, know that this is a basically a wedding proposal. I mean, once this is over, you can't think we can't think about this for right now. We need to stop <laughs> cataclysm. I'm gonna hang you. Shut the fuck up. Deal. Don't even Honestly, get me started. Deal. But I'll. But yeah, deal with the cataclysm. I'll keep your kids safe. And hopefully we both don't die at this. All right, all right. That's a that's a promise. And then you see Alexander, uh, pretty much just run off back to that inn, and then just tell uh Harris uh Gram. Yes, I'm telling Grandpa. Uh, uh, Gramps, uh, mm -hmm. you're gonna uh, can you take care of them for a quick second? I'm gonna pick up the last grandchild. And then you see Alexander you fucking You see him zoom. smile and pick up both the children on his shoulders. The man should the man not, should. but he is. And says, of course, I'll keep these guys. And then I just book it to the end. Alright. So, back over to Anulon. Okay, so Anulon will... Uh... Stop sending him memes, go... Alexander. <laughs> He's not even doing shit. <laughs> I just hear the will... ping. What do you? Oh. I hear the Discord No, you don't. Ping. Yes, I do. I have it you, on no, stream, bitch. No, no, you don't. You don't. No, you don't. <laughs> I, I'll, 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 I'll be know. right back. I gotta ask something. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Nulon. Ah, shit. All right, well, the new one is going to... Fuck it. He's just going to go... Uh, since he can't find Alexander, and Alexander's like, uh, the person he should be telling this shit to, uh, or maybe one of the people, he's actually going to tell Adalia. 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 Adalia is very Adalia. much inside her soup bowl. Hi. No. <laughs> okay. Adalia, okay. Look, I'm just going to explain this to you now very quickly. I know... You look quite pain. Are um, you alright? No. Maybe I need to explain something big, bad, something's happening, and uh, not fun. Okay. So what is happening right now is that I've just gotten writing that we've run out of time for something. There's no more time left for preparation. Uh, someone's been making mention about. Someone is freed. That means something bad is happening or something of the sorts. At least in terms of domino effects. And I think this relates a lot 
to Alexander. Are you sure you don't know where he went? Um... Do I? Do I remember where he's gone? Did you ask him where he's going? I was muted! And watching a video while <laughs> this is <was> happening. <laughs> to obey it, so sad. Welcome it, back to the reality. It, in, in, okay. in character, Alexander will have not told you. Alright. No, I... In that case, uh... Uh... Okay, in this case, uh, Alex Nanulon has an idea, but it's Blizzard out there. He is going to, he's going to make a call. He pulls out the book. Puck, look, I'm asking this once. Do not say anything. Where the fuck is Alexander? Time Church. And he gives you the address. Thank you. All right. Okay. Roll me. <laughs> you didn't IP even ask your patron who ID. is the go information guy. You, 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 you really asked the w worst person, and now you owe him a sex sake. Fuck. <laughs> you owe him sex. <laughs> You're dumb. Open... You're actually dumb. Actually brain dead. Uh, good luck getting pegged, boy. Uh, wish me luck, boys. <laughs> wish me luck. All right. A new one. I guess Kevin is getting another dad after all. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my word. Jesus. Okay. Puck it's wants tired to say that he's us. not like that. It's a tired night for all of us. It's a tired night for all of us. A new one's closing the book quickly, making a beeline. Uh, towards uh, the church. Like, he's just gonna, like, he's like, dash action, all that kind of stuff, um, just, like, running uh, over to the church. How long have I been running? You guys actually meet up in the middle. I just think, uh, oh. <laughs> I just think to tell uh, Anilon, no time to explain, I'm picking up Idalia, goodbye. He's following, like, no, 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 I need to come with you too, there is time to explain it to you. Uh, sure, if you can keep up, and you see Alexander keep yeah. basically dashing. Same with that. <laughs> the new one's going to keep dashing as well. Uh, he's just going to start explaining what's basically happening. Okay, book, uh, person, bronze writing, probably time god, said, uh, no more time. Path of Stars lot a thing, I don't know what the hell's going on. Uh, bad news, Puck basically sealed her away, and now that she's freeze, uh, I think bad shit's happening. And they said it related to a friend. Did you do something? Uh, you're too slow, and I cast haste on myself. Oh my fuck. <laughs> uh, 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 okay. You're too slow. Nulon looks at the haste. And the moment he runs to Nulon, can he, um, can Nulon roll insight? Uh, the basically guess what that could mean yes so you're gonna roll or what yeah <laughs> i am i just i just need to check the stat i'm sorry okay oh uh, 22 are rolling high tonight my word <laughs> Holy shit. Seeing that uh, Alexander is running away from you was running from where the direction the time church was and is trying to get to Idelia. His hairs, as the kids say, sus. Stop. Stop. What? You're not Granny Pombo. Shut Can the I fuck up. Can I my head out to see the shenanigans <laughs> coming towards me? Okay. Anulon. Oh. Anulon, upon this revelation, <laughs> has like a face of, oh, no. Uh, he is still basically running as fast as he can back to that fucking tavern. Like, no. I'm fucking, getting hit. What did from you do? <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, I would have thought so. <laughs> Am I gonna poke my head out the tavern door and see them like run? They are charging. Them? Oh no, they I'm are fucking... charging. They are dashing through the snow I, I, without I'm an so... open sleigh. I, I'm zooming. I have, I'm going 120. This fucker's going 60. Both of you oh, roll decks. Dude okay. is make. Both of you roll deck saves. All right. Dude has the zoomies, bro. To see if you guys are able to slow down fast Won. enough. Okay. To slow down fast enough to actually get inside the tavern door. <laughs> okay, both of you are able oh, to make the slowdown, even though you guys were basically dashing. One of you right. were zooming yeah. like a tabaxi, motherfucker. Um, I just tell uh, Idalia, where's your children? Where's your children? My, where's children? My, the, their little ones, my, my little ones over there and... Oh, oh dear. Wait, where's your little one? Uh, I told him to, uh, I'm looking for him right now. Uh, you need to start, uh, packing your stuff up, get to the adoption process. Uh, no time to explain. Uh, big shit's gonna happen. Go. Oh, and I just, like, and I just, like, shut, and I just, like, point towards your door and just, like, start How looking for my you boy. you finally catch up and, uh, catch yourself okay. onto the door, you're able to save yourself from eating your, eating ass. Eating your ass on the face. Oh, yeah. no one's probably going to eat. No one's probably going to eat ass later. Oh, oh. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably going to happen no matter what. Puck goes <laughs> dead. I don't think you're going to be the one being eaten. <laughs> no, anyways, not that's not. That. Oh, yeah, right. yeah, so, anyways, um, the moment a new long gun gets there, uh, whenever Alexander, uh, like, kind of does his stuff and then gets uh, past. Uh, <laughs> Nulon gets there, it's like, where is he? Where is he? Uh, Nulon, Nulon, what's going on? Okay, um, I think if this is all connected, and I think it's all connected, Alexander just did something that activated a lot of events domino style, and it is bring. and if we have to go fast, because if we don't, bad shit will happen, and Wait, world what? team shit might happen. You, um... <laughs> Okay, he's gonna grab her shoulders. Alexander did something with the time god. God is whatever. And the time god whatever it did broke a seal. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And whatever it did, it broke a seal Puck had placed. And now time continues on forward. I don't know, metaphysical level, whatever it may be. And it means something and a big event might occur. And if we're not quick enough to set an event, the world might fucking end because of it. What? He activated no. something, and I need to find it. How did this not have forewarning for... How Alexander, did you know this was going to happen? I, I'm, still on Zoom, I'm still in Zoomies mode. You trying are to able find to find fine. the child who is currently... Running around in the back of the tavern, not in the back of the tavern, but like outside behind the tavern. There's no nothing back there but a courtyard. He's running around butt naked right now. <laughs> Why is he running around? And get your damn clothes. That we need to fill out the papers now. What, what papers? H hold on. He like, you see him dig his clothes out of the snow and shake them and put them on. Well, oh. you see, I can't. Well, you see, I can't be your father if I'm not, you know, written by law. And I'll just be considered child trafficking. Now, please, we need to hurry up before, because there's a lot of things going to happen. And I want to keep you safe with the other two uh, brothers and, with your brother and sister. Come on. Okay. And, I, and then I just like, uh, he was you know what? Very much covered in snow. <laughs> you know what? Uh, no time to explain. Get in the bag, Nubby. And I just open. Uh, I just open up the bag of holding. Uh, it'll be real quick. Get in the bag. Uh, uh, okay, you see him stick his foot in there. I, I just said uh, another one to get in the bag. I'll just uh, go. <laughs> I'll go to Dahlia. I'll go to Dahlia and tell uh, her. Adele, and her. Adele, <laughs> okay, first of all, Alexander. As soon as you start to go to uh, Adelia, you see Analon talking to Adelia. Analon is not. Analon is my turn. Move out of the fucking way. Uh, Idalia, get in the fucking bag. Do? 
Well, Bitch, no, I need to. Uh, no, they can't. I don't fucking care. I've got my warnings, my messages too. What did you just do? I thought I was just free my grandfather. I wasn't told of anything else. You expected me to know this? You expected me to no, know? No, I do like, not, and that's fine. Yes, you can already yeah, guess. What's going on? Just, I, I, just, just get, just both of you get in the bag. We need to hurry up no, and fill up. No, no, we are, we are not getting in the bag. You see that the the boy's head pop out. What do you mean the bag is warm? I may have pissed in it. I don't want to get in no bag. Where is shiny? Uh, where is you, the fucking shiny? We're not taking care of shiny. Shut. We don't know where shiny is. That's the problem. Shiny is still in the cart. Oh shit! <laughs> I that's, I was look, I was I was looking at Anolan when he said oh, you're not taking care of him. And I was like, having this being figured out. He's pulling out the book. This was telling me what was going on. I had bronze writing telling me we're out of time, whatever that meant. And now I know what that means. Yes, yes. I caused another problem again, like I always do. Now please get in here before I. Mess up another problem. I'm already dealing with enough. Now we're, please. I'm not getting in no what bag. You while we're in there. Look, just it'll just be quick. I'm currently still under the effects what to go fast. I don't want to give me the bottle. Nulan is very hesitant, like extremely hesitant. Nulan, uh, but against his own good. His, his gut, he's just going for it, pulling out the bottle and handed it to him. Okay. They can't say not a non this water. Please give me a uh, oxygen mask. And I just like hand out like three copies to each one of them. Okay. Uh, here. It's too big to come out of the decanter. Oh my fucking god. I guess I just. Yes. Does that mean I need to reach? Does that mean I need to reach out for it then? No. Nope. It oxygen mask. It doesn't <sighs> come out. Uh. Uh, and it's a concert on water. Give me, um, oxygen. No, it's not gonna. Oxygen tank. That's not gonna come out either. It's too big. Okay, you know what? Let's slow down so the children know what's going on. Well, that's I already. I, I don't think the children will understand. We just need to fill out the the paper process so they can actually be taken care of. Where it? Where are the little ones gonna stay? Uh, What's going on? they're gonna uh, they're gonna stay at the guard. They're gonna they're gonna be taken oh, care of by the church. We already ha gently pick up the little one and hold. It. I'm not yeah. sure. Where? We're, we're figuring out right now. All right. They're gonna be. They're gonna. They're gonna go to the guard. They're gonna be under protection while we take care of. Well, <sighs> we and myself will take care of this problem. Because currently, we, they cannot get protection unless they're under our name legally as their parents. That's why I want you to go. Now, please, we need to be haste about this because they're preparing the... What, what church? The Church of Time. Oh, you mean Big Clock Lady. Yeah, Big Clock Lady, yeah. We need to go there and finish, <laughs> and finish the adoption process. That's what's telling you to get in the bag before my spell runs out. I can oh, move there. But the I'll boy move there. pissed in that bag. The bag is large, and if you want, I can just, like, clean it. And do you know what? You kid, know what you are you... Clean, kid, what are you... Kid, what are you... Fuck, what are you pissed? Everywhere. <laughs> I, 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 I just... I just... I just that take is my... accurate for children. I just <laughs> take... I used to take my hand down and I just spammed the fuck out of Prejudice Station. <sighs> there. 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 How long will it take for me to clean the piss? <laughs> you didn't piss everywhere, but you did. Seven years. Hey, there you go. What the fuck? No you you, you tell me. No, 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 no. You telling me this fucker pissed fucking lakes worth of piss? <laughs> and he, besides that, um. Okay, there. I cleaned the, I, I cleaned, I cleaned the urine. I cleaned it already. Already. Now please get on. 
please. Uh, can you hang on? Seven seven hundred years of pure piss. Okay. Uh, <laughs> might as might as well ask the other child. Do you want to get on my back? I guess. Sure. <laughs> All right. Pissed. I just. <sighs> Okay. Uh, word, that's all he's going to say. Uh, okay. Uh, before and before we start going out there, I'm just gonna. Okay, Dahlia, since you won't get in the bag, Debbie, get in the bag. I I, I just I just pat Idalia on the head, and I twin spelled haste on us. There. Now Ooh. catch. Now you're gonna now catch up, and then you see Alexander fucking zoom. Now square up, child. Uh, ready, little one? It is little one with me. Oh, okay. She nods and holds uh, on tight. All right, hold on. And Adalia is also gonna zoomy zoom. We're on the lawn, left in the dust. It's once okay. Again. A new lawn. A new wanted to go to get shiny anyways because shiny's in the <laughs> fucking car, maybe. And we, and, uh, new needs to take everyone. Plus, he needs to write in the damn book. Uh, he needs to know some more shit. He opens the book and is basically going to be writing to his uh, moon goddess uh, because I remember because this was told to him before way early. Path of Stars. What the? What is this? This so is leaving my is mind. not the one that answers, but it is instead your patron. Oh, I can answer okay. that one. The Path of Stars is a collection of well magical runes that will activate upon in about mm, three months Wait, you have months. five minutes five episodes later you have four minutes not, not, <laughs> three seasons later on the summer solstice i forgot pardon me they'll activate upon the summer solstice and you can traverse to an area that has been untouched by time basically the court of the gods uh, but I will warn you, if you're not back by the summer solstice morning, you will be left there. But, I mean, you can wait an entire year and come back. However, since there has been a barrier put in place by the dragon god king, Harris... There's really been no need to send people over. Wait, so the dragon... Wait, so are we talking like dragon god king? Or dragon god whose name is king? Dragon god king. Full title. I see. His name is Harris. So he's a pussy. <laughs> Since the barrier has been, well, taken... Well, it, if it is going to open back up, it'll... We need either his or his descendants' blood to deactivate the barrier. And you have one descendant in your party, it's probably that. But, I mean, he does have a sister who's still alive. And uh, his brother, well, he doesn't have a brother, so thank fuck for that. But, um, if you're going to be doing that, by going over the Path of Stars... You'll be going basically back to where you were before you fell, Adalon. Uh, Nulan. Uh, it's like after this, and it's like, I don't have... there. And Nulan just kind of like uh, shakes his head. He's already like not have uh, a good memory, as in like, it's already fleeting uh, <laughs> that place. Uh, but to have him just fucking rush to there now is definitely not giving good feels. He thinks, uh, he writes back though. Uh, thank you very much for the information. Um, okay, so I now know that Alexander had something to do. I don't care if it was a mistake. I just need to know, what did he just do? He did your mom. He basically <laughs> unfroze time. The barrier wasn't supposed to last this long, but if you freeze the time goddess or seal her power... You will effectively stop time for any magical apparatus that is currently working right now. They're kind of in a frozen state of on. Like, say, the dwarven giant 
fake star that they have. Now it has a countdown to when it'll stop working. Or say uh, the the teleportation circles that someone has used recently near the uh, what is it? What do you guys call it? The fire gate? Yeah. Or the mechs that they have made. Or Chinese copper. Technically, now he has an expiration date. Oh. Expiration date yesterday. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Instantly and dies. A lot of the magic will no longer, will no longer work longer. after a while. <laughs> Unless it was given yeah. either by bloodline, divinely, or, you know, in case of one Warforged, both. He's oh, you can a... already tell. <laughs> Well, he, I mean, he the, was given it divinely by uh, church and state, so he's kind of covered. He can already imagine the moment that oath and a war forge, quote unquote, was mentioned. He could vividly remember who uh, they were, uh, who is on about with that. Ah, uh, yes, prime. Knight. He then writes back. <clears throat> mm -hmm. He's just like, ah, yes, prime knight. Met him once. That name. Somehow fucking sticks. Oh, he writes. Uh, he writes back. He writes back. Uh, thank you very much. This information is very vital to exactly understanding what is going on. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. you thank you. Thank wizards you. or bards, uh, tell them that their days are numbered for having the ability to manipulate magic. Bye. <laughs> he closes the book and is just like, "Oh no, Adalia." Uh, he goes in trying to look for uh, the, the kobold goblin. Where the fuck is he at? He's in the cart. Oh, no, but he's going to go in the cart. He's like, where the fuck are you, goblin? Please. Please be in here. Shiny. Shiny. Yeah. You've been so engrossed in figuring out exactly what's going on with Copper. Because Copper said that uh, something ain't feeling right, chief. And Mr. Stark, I'm not feeling so good. <laughs> uh, you are pouring over copper, making sure that everything's up to spec, making sure the manual is still the correct. And then suddenly Avalon pops in through the back of the cart. I'm going to smack him in the face. <laughs> just like on reflex, just backhand him. Anulon would accept the backhand. Uh, and just look at Shiny. It's like, Shiny, Shiny. Right. Oh, thank God you're fucking here. No, I'm not. Wait, why were you Dis here? Disappears. <laughs> no, please don't go, Shiny. This is important. I need to explain this to you. <laughs> I need to deliver exposition, please. Shiny, please. I need to dump all the exposition on you now. God, no, don't listen to exposition. <laughs> now you have to listen to exposition. Come on, show yourself. You can't make me too witty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, cast management. It'll be very myself. brief. Go basically on. saying magic... Basically saying magic is dying. Copper is practically dying. Now. Um... Uh... Somehow some fucking... Well, no, now I know fucking... Uh, Alexander just broke the barrier and unfroze time. He, now time is working uh, actually, and that means a big event is happening, and if we don't get the right time, uh, something goes wrong, and the whole planet may have be, uh, may be uh, dead under. Hey. Do you need a better explanation? Hey. <laughs> I'm saying that your copper friend is almost dying. Where is copper anyways? Is he there? I'm right here. Literally, like, sitting on copper. I oh. said oh, okay. I was He's feeling like, oh, weird, shit. not that I was dying. Sorry, this is going to be Well, your, your days are numbered is basically what I'm saying. Just to Are you threatening you copper? No, no, I'm not threatening copper. I'm explaining that in a more, uh, in a time sense, way out of our control now, um, 
Copper's days are numbered. Magic is dying for... Oh, wouldn't artificers be affected? Or is that not it? That's, or is it just wizards like... Wizards and bards. I don't... Oh, shh. So anything that oh. was given by something else is no-go? Yeah, I think that's how it is. I... Unless your magic is given to you by something? No. Mine is given to me by science. I don't think that's that's going to pass, dude. Because that happens with wizards, too. I think your your magic is a number. Your magic is math. Your ma my, you're not, my you're magic not... is, is understanding how physics works. Your, your magic, so you don't you don't have magic. You're just an engineer. The fuck you I, mean? I am the engineer from TF2. Not built, not built a fucking teleporter, bitch. We're losing the battle. <laughs> Thank okay, so he's going to say, okay, so I magic just start is dying. Building a century gun. Tink, tink. Just like, tink, 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 tink. Hold on, where the hell? Hold on, hold on. Where Boom, that gear up. Ah, yes. Enemy spies in your brain. Everyone's dead. So. That's an actual uh, Allen wrench. Not Allen wrench, monkey wrench. It's five pounds. Oh, monkey that's an is... Monkey is monkey. monkey. Ah, hold on. Moment, let me show it. Monkey. It's been a while so since I magic have is camera. dying at least for oh, the given oh, people. Why is this not working? Ooh, monkey, monkey, you, monkey. You gotta oh, wait it's... for your camera, eh? camera to turn on correctly. I gotta, uh, I gotta flip to it. Don't worry. Yeah, you gotta flip. There it is. Huh? Damn, the f I didn't ah! think the floodgates would open this fast. Oh, <laughs> that damn, you remember what difference? Oh, uh, this is an entirely different area, by the way. This is my old room. This is just the upper area. Uh, I'm back at home. I'm back uh, from my sister's room. Alright, so Welcome this back. is what an actual monkey wrench looks like. This is what the TF2 monkey wrench looks like. So... Yeah. Damn. Man's got big-ass hands. Shit. Yeah. Um, anyway. So, uh, so magic is... Magic is dying. Um, you could. Yes, you can. It's All right, engineering. I don't care. Gun. Gun, 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 gun. gun the new gun, gun. is like, you know what? Ignorance and bliss, I think that's fine with me. Um, he's just kind of like uh, going to just keep watch, still watch over the thing because now he can't catch up. And I don't think uh, at this point they're way too far gone for him to even want huh, to catch up anymore. It's all he's staying behind. Shiny has created basically an all terrain vehicle. I what? would never have created an all terrain vehicle before. I'm going to get in the driver's seat and turn it on. No, please. It's He's copper. Talking. Copper is the all-terrain vehicle. Oh yeah. I mean, yeah. You don't uh, have to oh right, I've got uh, motorcycle wheels on copper. Exactly <laughs> what I said. Yep. For a second, I thought you you said that he straight up be like a jeep, fucking. No. <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, <laughs> copper is just a is just a dog looking motorcycle. <laughs> yes. Motherfucker. So uh, just you know the Zenoger, uh, you know the Zenoger heavy bow gun. It looks like that. But it's actually... Ah, okay. <laughs> By the way, just figured out that the Zenoga heavy bowgun from Monster Hunter Rise looks exactly looks like a motorcycle with no wheels. Anyway, dun, 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 um, dun, dun. uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna hop on copper. It's like, all right, let's go. Vroom vroom. Wait, There's you don't enough... even know what the fuck. There's enough room for Onalan to get on. You actually uh... sit on the. You're actually sitting on the tail, though. Yeah. You have to sit behind Shiny. That's Shiny fine. Doesn't take up a shit. He will sit behind. I right, nuance dude still sit behind. Onwards to victory and death. <laughs> Please stop! Don't get this exaggerated. All right, let's go up. Yeah. You see, uh, Copper hops out of the back of the car and zooms off towards the time temple. All right. Uh, so, Alexander and Idalia, you guys skid in front of the Time Temple and are able to get inside. Oh, are you alright, little one? Uh, yeah, yeah. I, I just, like, mm. I just, like, go ahead. Okay, kid, uh, uh, this, you see, there's gonna be a little part right there that's gonna say will you accept and just, just sign your name. Trust. And, okay, uh, he kind of like uh, flings himself <laughs> off of you. Okay, uh, where's, the, where's that, where's that cleric? Where's that damn cleric? 
you see the cleric quickly gathering her stuff. She looks uh, like an old adventurer, so... Huh? Oh, I understand. Hi! Uh, yeah. Give me, give me a second, man. Here. Papers? Uh, yeah, thank you, and I just, ex and I, uh, where's the second, where's the second copy, if you have uh, one? Uh, here, hands it, hands it over. Here you go, second copy. I just used Mage Hand to pass it over to Idalia. Alright, Idalia, you now have oh. adoption papers. Alright, little one, I guess it's time. Do you want me to adopt you? Yeah, that, that sounds nice. Alright, then, I will... I, I think I was carrying the little one, so I'll set the little one down and get to signing. The little one's gonna claw, claw her way up onto one of the pews here and goes, This seat's uncomfortable. Well, uh, I suppose, I suppose, uh, it, it is a church, right? You did, it is a church, so I suppose if you're not gonna be here all the time, you, it, you wouldn't need to make the pews comfortable. They're going to another church. The church is going to be better, trust. Uh, uh, okay. Why if you... did you not say trust me instead of... I trust Miss Sedalia. Trust. Oh, I, I mean, Mom. <laughs> it, if you're not comfortable calling me Mother yet, that's all right. She's all right. kind of qual uh, climbs off the pew and goes over and grabs your leg and hugs you. I'll I'll try to call you, mom. Uh, all right, kid. You got you got it done. How how am I basically done with my part of the signing? Yes. How do you spell Derek? Uh, do you like do you want an A or an E? What's an A? What's an E? <sighs> okay, I'll just I just pull out my notebook. Okay. You okay? And I just write Derek with an A, and I just write Derek with an E. Which one do you like? E, the one okay. on the bottom. All right, I okay. You have to write that on this paper. Okay. He like <laughs> he like grips the pen for dear life and tries his best. You see <laughs> Harris with the other two children just watching and goes, "Oh boy," and he kind of like comes over to you. Alexander goes, what dragon is he? Uh, French, French dragon. Uh, I, I just, I just lift the child up for any, like, any scales. Hey. Uh, what, uh, what scales do I see? Supreme. He's a supreme dragon. No. I'm the supreme dragon here. No, no he has no oh, clout what, what, what color scales is he? I think we said he was, uh, I think we said he was, like, He has to be, like, a fire dragon. He has to be a metallic fire dragon. He so, can't... either gold or brass. I'll, s I'll say, but he's an ogre, though. No, he he's orc. O orc, orc still, my bad. Ogre is something different. Brass. He was a brass? Okay, brass. Brass, okay. Uh, and Dad, I, and put I, me back down. I have I just to put, put the C. I and I just put it down. Don't worry. I was just monkey with the speed. sharp rock is he, absolutely my spirit animal. He is brass. Huh? At least He's until brass Larry. like my. No, 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 no. Don't worry. That's perfectly fine. I thought he was bronze. My bad. Uh, do what? You, you know got what? a problem with bronze dragons? Does does my one need help signing I her? <laughs> I thought he was going to be like a druid, like his dad. Um. Bronze dragon of the harvest. He was a god. He, honest. Cringe. Continue. I'm, uh, Part of Averton. Why the reason why they have I, such I, nice. I, I'm trying. I'm trying to fucking talk, but it was interrupted. I'm, uh, his, he he has children, yes, but they haven't hatched. Pardon? Uh, they didn't. Ha uh, the eggs were kept in a village, you see. And nor they did not have the gum. heat nor the money to hatch them. You had the money. I have How the money now. Two. Sixty-three. 
No, there was two, but there was a smaller one. What came out of a smaller one? Uh, I just ca I cast message to Shiny. Wait. What? What? What was a uh, what was your dragon again? Platinum. What kind? Platinum. No, it was a it was a white dragon. Well, white wyvern. Could I say that along? And I just hang up. Uh, he's a white dragon. The smaller one. Fuck. Sorry, what? children, do not say that word. The children. I agree with what she said. Don't, it, don't. That, that's a... The children are gonna start saying. Uh, that, that, that's, that's my grand... That's... That's my grandpa. Wait, wait. Where are they? Hello. Where are they? Uh, there. I thought, I thought the lady was there. No, okay. It's a gr I I agree with him. Them. The struggles. The struggles. Uh, there. Honestly, uh, the last time I remember it, the the white, the king of the north, and the bronze dragon took him. Son, do you? Re Grandson, sorry, if you were there, you said you look exactly like your father. Grandson, Never met him, but thank you. Do you happen to remember Baphomet and Tiamat? The old type of stories? Please don't say that. Please don't say that cursed name in my household. Sadly, Sad I think you just basically are incubating the dragon dragon gods. Thankfully, oh, we're going to have CR30 monsters, Pog. Thankfully, Pog. you will be able to recreate the dragons. The bad news is, bad that you news have is you basically unleashed an interesting side effect of awakening me. I hope you like a CR thirty monster with uh, two health bars. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> I, I I know. I know. I I choose. I choose to be good for once, and I'm still getting punished for it. I no, can't even breathe. No, it's good. It's good that you awaken them and not awaken them. You're basically recreating them. It's good because then all the dragons will come back. But it's bad because further down the line, Diamond and Baphomet will start to bicker with each other and then start to fight. That's As fine they do. because. I'm if it happens Honestly, in... where you guys are going, they kind of need to to restart everything. <sighs> it's so I always cause I always cause chaos. Eh, it runs in the bloodline. The chaos. Yeah, yeah, Embrace but this. Chaos. Be but this. Stupid. By this point, I'm gonna become the, the the dragon god of death and chaos eventually. Who knows? There's but anyway, two people dealing with that. Don't worry about that. Yeah, yeah, and I'll be the third who's gonna take up the mantle. Don't worry, Grandpa. All right, uh, kid, you finished done signing? Yep. Yeah, Dolly, My name are you done? Derek. Thank you, Derek. Um, are you? No one, are you done with signing? Uh, I, I think so. Here, let me check. Did Did she sign her name? Yes. All right. Uh, I just I see what her name is. Rosa. Rosa. Aww. Yep, she's done. Retconning right. their names. Retconning. <laughs> retconning the, retconning the names that were never given. Anyways. No, I didn't give them. I just Wait, did? It. Fair. I'll, I'll, we'll watch you eventually. Anyways, uh, I just used Mage Hand to hand over the pages. No, now what? Uh. Now Derek you... looks over and points up to Harris. Are you my granddad? Yes. He's your great, great granddad, actually. Oh! I want to wrestle! Uh... <laughs> Damn it. Oh, this is your grandfather, Alexander? Yeah, yeah, oh yeah. My God, he just said that. Yeah. You guys start to hear the revving of... Uh, the cutoff of an engine outside the temple. Hanalan and Shiny are here. I'm just revving the motorcycle engine, enjoying it. 
Yeah, Sorry, well, Anula gets off and starts going into the church. Uh, and just seeing everything go down. Uh, I'm going to start making what, donuts in the parking lot. So, I cannot remember, did, like, uh, the grandpa change in appearance, or did he still look the same? He looks the same. He looks the same, except a little bit healthier, and he looks like he's getting healthier by every minute. Alright, well, the moment Nulan enters and see, uh... Kill him. Shoot him in the head. <laughs> no. Shoot him in the head. Oh, just blood. Let's go. No. Um... No, 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 just pull out your, pull out your revolver and shoot him in the head. Oh, wait, I haven't gotten Dude. my gun yet! That's all Alright, so, Nulan gets into the church uh and uh, just sees the the papers and then just sees the grandpa was like oh the cleric the children your teammates the time god and herself just what? chilling wait what what new yeah. just looks and sees her wait, uh and just time god jelly what she's literally you up think there the statue is just a statue until it moves. She be, she be, she do be moving. Though. She's coated with the sauce. Anyways, uh, <laughs> yeah. Anulon sees uh, oh, first the on. goddess and waves. Please so he nice. then uh, he then looks at Grandpa and is like, "Oh hello." Uh, Anulon just kind of like stunned for a little bit. Uh, Oi. Cleric of the, the moon, it. please move. You see a uh, short cleric hustle through the doorway past you. Oh, a new line moves out of the way. It's like, oh, my apologies. Busts in the door. Somebody! No. But I do go in. I do go inside. And also, here's the... Here's the coal. Crime! And, and I just do like a sly smile to my grandfather, and I'm like, he's a pro he's a troublesome one. Hey, Dad. Harris kind of just looks at. Oh the my fucking god! Harris looks <laughs> at the uh, looks at the gremlin that just called him dad. He says, "I ain't your dad." He, he's um. <laughs> he's, he's, he's referring. Anyways, uh, okay. Um, we have the thing settled. Uh, Archbishop, is there anything else that you need help with? Outside, the Archbishop answers no. Oh, I left. Uh, oh wait, no. Left big rubber ring on on ground outside. Grin stupidly. Wait. Uh... <laughs> Oh. Basically, he, he read, uh, well, he left, um, tire marks everywhere. And what, what happened? Oh. Alexander, um... Yes? I don't believe I ever got in detail what will happen to Rosa due to this whole thing. That I said that she's gonna be sent to Tulip Guard and be... taken care of for the meanwhile where we take care of... Like, uh, clerics. Uh, I we we actually know a few, uh, quite a few of them, because we benched Tulip Guard right on the lawn. Don't worry, little one. She's yes. going to the Tulip Guard in the sky. Yeah, Bye. he flirt. Yeah, he flirted with one of them, by the way. Anyways, uh. <laughs> yes, he did. Uh, <laughs> if you if you want to still have her, I still have her name. You can access. It's right here. Oh no. But, but yeah, they'll be they'll be sent to Tulip Guard, and they'll be taken care of by the clerics over there. Oh dear! And I thought I would be able to arrange things myself for you. Uh. Paris whispers something in your ear, Alexander. <laughs> yeah. Looking What's down. the old guard of the sun doing here, and why does he fallen? I just whisper. Wait, huh? I just whisper. You know what? No, I, I just, that's you, dipshit. Uh, I, I oh. just, I just gonna uh, subtle spell message just so it can be funny and just like look at Anolan, like, just look at Anolan with like a dead face, like, and you say, 
Um, he's currently under many depths with a lot of powerful women, and I I don't know. I honestly don't know. He's horny. Paris puts know. down the children, goes to to on a lawn, pats him on the back, and goes, "Ah, another harem fucker." <laughs> wait, wait. Anula looks down uh, at Adam, was just like, "Wait, I, I, I." Oh yeah, I was gonna. Anula is just kind of like just his mind is just going just <laughs> blank. It's just it's everything that just happened in a span of like minutes uh is basically just now uh fucking with him now. Uh what? Oh, I should probably introduce myself to your friends, right, grandkid? And great grandkids. <laughs> I, uh, 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 sure. Everyone, this, everyone, this is my grand, my grandfather, uh, Harrison Thompson. Harrison Thompson, here's my, here's my party. He, there's the couple, like I mentioned before, yeah. that's shiny, and there's Idalia Silver, Silver Birch, Charm. and then, I will curtsy. And then I, and then I just point at Anulan, and here is Anulan Dunkirk, or, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go, uh, walk over to do, like, pull on his sleeve and be like, when are we getting gun? Uh oh yeah, I forgot. Wait, did he? I thought you had t I thought you went already. Dude. No, don't have gun yet. Want gun. Uh after after the paperwork is done, I'll I'll I I guess I I'll fill out the sh form to get you the gun. I, we can go after this. Uh, he, ha half pot I, I, I just pull out a I just put a potato out of my ring and say, shut just just calm down for a second. Shiny takes the potato, op like pulls a uh, pulls a weird wooden box with three compartments from behind him, shoves the potato in, shakes it around a little bit, then uh, then takes the potato out and eats it. The fuck? Uh, <laughs> so I have this new thing, and uh, this is my introduction for it. I have a quiver of uh, Helana, and um. Which is a uncommon magical item that has three compartments that connect to extra dimensional space that can hold any object uh, that is uh, basically uh, I can hold a lot of different objects like um, and they're separated by size. So like um, javelins, arrows, bolts, bows, spears, and a lot of different things. Potatoes. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, here I can send you the link to the item if you want it. That'd be nice. Towards Rosa with a small side. I thought I was um, gonna be able to arrange everything for you. And I did I pick this up from. Things. Oh, go ahead. I thought I was oh. gonna be able to arrange things so we can spend time at least while you're in between adventuring, but I suppose this is a rather short notice. Uh. Mom, are you going to marry Mr. Alexander? What? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I just do I hear I, wedding bells in the distance? Give me a give me a charisma saving throw right now, child. All right, I'll do it. What you can do? A... <laughs> I, I guess roll. I don't know. No, no, no. That is no. I I just I just. I fail. I get shunted to Ohio. You're not going to Ohio. I'm sending no. you. No, not Baltimore. That. No, I'm gonna <laughs> send you that. to Tampa, who, Florida. Who, who, I'm joking. Who, who said that he was your father? I'm, I'm joking. So on the sheet. Uh, wait, wait, oh, yeah. wait, hold on, hold on. Uh, wait, I didn't write my name as a father. I didn't. I only wrote my spot. I only wrote as father here. Did you? Come on. Uh, the Archbishop is gone. Did did you roll me as your father, child? Uh uh. It was already on the sheets. That. Okay, at least uh, Alexander didn't sign it himself. Woo. Okay. Um. Uh, honestly, uh, no, no offense intended, but I don't, I don't know. I honestly. Harris kind of like leans on. Leans Don't. on Anilon and goes, wow, already getting turned down. I already have someone. Uh, yeah, 
The time cleric. Shh. And I just point at him directly. Shut. <laughs> and you. Who? I. I just. Just calm down. That crazy oh. little thing that went out the door. Basically, Grandpa, please. Grandpa, please. I... Please, you can't, you can't start doing this now. Um, I have first to make up for time. Gram Grandpa, please. Look, please. I don't want to get that more does embarrassed. Does mean that Dahlia is going to marry the shadow man over there? <laughs> so what the fuck is he talking about? It Rosa is gonna... pointing directly at Avalon. No, 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 Rosa, Rosa, that's not, no. Uh, uh, look, look, I'm, look, uh, Rosa, Rosa, I'll be, uh, I'll just be straight up honest with you. Your mother has no, has no person to marry right now. She has no prospects. For shame, a bard with no game. I... And we'll say nothing. Do not that. send me that while I'm trying to eat cotton <laughs> candy, dude. Get, get, oh. I'm gonna say nothing to that comment. <laughs> you get I no. Right on a death. <laughs> go get, go get. <laughs> if I hear from someone, I wouldn't know I had, I had someone. That's the problem. No, you have no one. No, it's but because I... someone's locked no one's their brain. Left her, Alex, and now he's gonna like tap her head to like underline her point. Someone's locked her memory. Quite a nasty spell, too. Wait, you know what it is? Yeah. Well, I wouldn't be the Dragon King if I didn't. Grandpa. You know a way to fix it? Uh, never mind. Just, just go. F I mean, I could. Or you get the people who put it on you to take it off. Well, I don't remember who put it on me. Fur books. Ever Fair. go went through a woods one day and suddenly you're turned around? Or maybe you were on a boat and suddenly you were I... across a lake and then suddenly you're back at the middle? I was in a boat. Mmm, nasty. Must have done a water migration. Oh. Well, how would I find a furball now? Mmm, but no. Oh dear. I've only come in contact, like, two tribes of furballs? That was on the eastern side of this damned place. Oh, and we're on the west, aren't we? Oh, why does everything have to be across the country? I mean, technically it's the north, so... Oh, you guys Not don't too know that. Far oh, fuck. Um... Slowly turning her head to look at him. Kronos! Should I have told him that? He kind of like turns to look at the statue that slowly just moves. Oh wait, that statue's moving! Did you not? Yeah. Did you not notice? She was literally looking at. Oh, okay. There Time were, is. There are other things going on at the moment. Time is relevant, but right now it's probably the best time for them to hear. Come on. Can we just freeze you again? No. I didn't actually say that. I didn't actually say that. Oh, damn it. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I hear you, Cleric of the Moon, and... Wow. Harem Keeper. What is... Uh, I Harem. don't even Harem remember is, half it... this shit. Harem <laughs> Keeper, but no bitches still. No. He's oh. loved by his goddess. But... He is known by many to have, well, known many women, even though he really hasn't. And Noah is just like throwing his hands in the air like, I'm, oh, I'm, I'm being told at this point. Don't worry, so, it will come into contact. Oh, 
Which I... timeline is this? I don't know. Timeline? Oh, there are many timelines. No one's going to go back to the memory, or at least when in that sleep <clears throat> thing, uh, and the dream where, like, uh, whatever the fuck was happening with quote unquote simulation, and he's just going to be like, he just has his hands on his head, uh, like both of his hands is kind of like on the top of his head, like. <laughs> Oh my god, I don't even know what's happening. Time. Oh. How are we done here? Or do we also, still have more to do? I think you're looking for this. She takes something out of her arm and it's a large mirror fragment. I assume I'm just going to find them everywhere. Yes, I am looking for them. She hands it over to you. It was part of the reason why I was nope. sealed. Oh. Wait, uh, thank you. I found this. out um, about the mirroring of life that happened in different timelines. I tried my best, but in the end, it never really matters. The new line. Is this for the hand mirror now, or uh, again? Or it is for the shield. The shield. You're. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, the shield, the shield. I thought the shield wasn't broken. Okay, that's fine. The shield is, uh, not, is slowly growing with every mirror shard, but this is a large uh -huh. mirror shard. Anulon grabs shard. Uh, just kind of put it near the shield. You see the you see Here? the shield and the mirror shard disappear. Ah, oh, dear. Leaving you the decanter. But. And it like grabs the, the decanter. Finally changes form. It is now a dark, shimmering hymnal with a single drop of moonlight on it. Oh shit, do I lose everything on the shield then? No, 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 that pops off. Everything oh, you okay. put in there was is is yours, but it's no longer in the shield. Oh, okay. You're just changing form. Oh, okay. I'm changing forms. Yeah. Your patron is finally complete. The mirror goddess is finally complete. I know. I'm just kind of flabbergasted at this point. Like he's got no words. It's, he's got nothing to say about this. Like, fuck, it's just happening. Fuck it. Wait, finished. Okay, so completed. Yes. Dunzo. What does that mean now? You'll have to see. Okay. Harris just looks over at you and goes, Huh. Made a deal with an eldritch being, did you? I was originally planning for revenge on those who damned me. And thus, you know, he pointed at himself, presented himself as Fallen and Warlock. And then this happened. Mm. At this point, I didn't. I didn't. Nasty. I didn't think it'd go this way. Nasty, nasty, nasty. Anyway, I'll take the kids down to the guard. Kind of like scoops up all the children. Scoop. Scoop. You see Rosa wave and yell, "Bye, mm -hmm. bye, Mama." Oh, I'm gonna miss you, Rosa. Derek just gives, tries to get, uh, tries to get Alexander's attention. Hey, a new dad. What? What? What, Derek? I learned a new trick. You want to see it? Should Go I for gun? it. Did I double, hear a gun? Double bird. Trick. Oh, wait. What? I, I flipped double bird back. 
Yeah. No, it's not. <laughs> you did not oh, just yeah. taught my child that you fucking lesser lizard. Lizard, <laughs> don't. Don't do double birds to anyone. Uh, okay. I'm gonna show. Uh, I'm gonna show the child how to do gang signs. Don't you? I think you. <laughs> I think I'm gonna send you to somewhere cold. Daddy, if you God. do it, I will no longer have my track record of being a pacifist. Oh no, not <laughs> not Delia's child. I'm talking about the child who flipped me off. <laughs> Teaching that one gang signs. He he tries to copy the gang signs back. Next thing. But before that can happen, you see Harris disappear in a beam of light. Mm. Oh yeah, weren't we supposed to kill him? No, no, no. Oh, what? <laughs> you are aware. You, you know what? Try killing him. You know what? Go ahead. Go try. Go try. No, weren't uh, we supposed to kill him because he was he was doing something to mess with magic or something like that? He was sealed that away. Shut, shut, shut. No one's talking to you. Shut. No one's talking You're to you. You're still in my church. Oh, oh, I'm ta I'm, I thought you were someone else. Uh, my bad. Uh, m I don't know what you call you, so I'm gonna call you ma'am. Call, 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 call them the N-word. Call them the N-word. What, what's... Kronos, it's the what's... easiest in your tongue. Oh, 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 I feel slightly disrespected, but okay, Bronos. Salutations, Kronos. Okay, we're gonna... We're gonna walk away now, and I just like wave to them to like get out. We'll we'll have yeah. our own we'll have our own talk later. Uh, yeah, our way out. Oh, uh, no, madam. No, stay a while. You hear the door slam shut. Ma oh, Ma madam, please, please. So I don't want any more commotion now. We we have to go and prepare. You know. Yeah, you gonna... You've already Look. prepared. We're we're not. Well, I, I promise you, we're not mentally or financially. You know, like hold her lantern up and look through it. I tell you, what you see is a large wo woman-like figure. She's feminine, uh, but she's like surrounded by floating gears that tick at different rates. It's the it's the steampunk woman. <laughs> Yes, actually. <laughs> yes. One hundred percent right. Steampunk woman. But you Steam see something. Woman. Uh, I wouldn't say it's clothing, but at least it covers her it's bits. It's lingerie. I'm kidding. No, no, it covers her bits. <laughs> okay. Wait, was I right? So, what do you know about the champion of order? Uh, which which his one? Name Dr. Fate. His name is Galileo, and he's running. Nice. From me. Galileo, Galileo, Galileo. I knew it. I fucking knew it. <laughs> you're going. You're going to an outskirts of Russia. But he likes me. He's just a poor boy from a poor family. Wait, wait, it's just wait, wait, please. Da, 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 will you let me go? Will you let me go? Will you let me go? Let me go. Uh, no, no. He needs to hear that. Continue. Let me go. Let me go. It just keeps going. 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 It just keeps can you tell us, like, the general location where we need to pick or kill this person? Oh, Whatever. no. You don't need to kill him. Last known location. Let's see. What day is it? Ah. Uh, Dwarven Empire. I believe you haven't gotten the... No. No, that's a different timeline. Okay. Dwarven Empire. Bye! So is this one Wait also part of Anuon Tarim, or is it just one of the side bitches? No. This is one that's giving you a mission. Ah. Uh, okay, so last seen Dorian Empire, currently running away, etc, etc. Are anything else you want us to keep note of? Ah. Uh, 
I believe he's attached his soul to a very tall adamantine form. Uh, one currently hosted by a prime knight. He should be coming here. Oh, uh, Newell, I just... I, I just to make sure that you're able to... Everyone cringes. Catch I, him. I, I just look at uh, Anilon and we might kill something. Anulon, at the name, at the mention of Prime Knight, is just kind of like, oh, it's all connected. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Anulon, it's almost as if I uh, name dropped the Champion of Order early the earlier this session for this. Wait, so who's the Champion it's all of connected, Chaos? Yeah. The Champion of Chaos is currently one of Puck's children. So, uh, I see. so I need to take that title from him. <laughs> yes. He's, cur <laughs> he's currently the Prime Minister of Muestra, so good fucking luck. I'm going to take the title of Chaos. And that is when this is where we'll end tonight's session. You try to steal that shit, you're gonna get trick shot in. <laughs> when, I just... when Sarah learns how, how weapons work. <laughs> yep, Sarah finally I... learned how weapon modding just... works. I just want, I just want my gun, man. Can I? Can, I you can get your gun, gun next session. There was stuff that I needed to finish this session. Fair enough. Fair enough. I just want my gun. A new. Oh, uh, so wait. What was a new long column? Uh, I, I just kind of missed out on something. Uh, it was like Claire an old moon. guardian of wire. I know. I, well, no, that one. But he said I was something else before that. Uh, Unless what I are you talking about, Harris? Else. Harris called Harris, you. Harris, like mentioned. Um, Sun, guardian of the sun or something like this. Oh, guard of the oh. sun. Gotcha. I this just was before that you thing. fell. Yes. <laughs> some he does not remember so far. Yeah. Anyway, that is session. Hey. Next session, we'll be able to get Chiny his gun. Alright, well, I'm gonna go call uh, some children the n-word, so I'll catch you later. Okay. okay. No. Oh, dear. <laughs> Uh, wow, that was quick. So that was a that, that was a lot. Uh, this was a lot of lore. Nice to you guys had a very strenuous time working with Wrath, so I thought, you know what? Let's wrap up a couple of missions that have been on the back burner. Yeah. Mm hmm. Oh. Uh. So, is there anything special that happened with the book that I should be known of, or is that just the? It has changed from your packed item to a. a it's basically change covers. It's still a packed item. Uh-huh. It just looks fancier. Okay. Yeah, because you completed everything. It now takes after more of your god than your patron. Because your patron All doesn't right. need to look at you anymore. <laughs> My you patron no longer... <laughs> He's like, I'm done! Fuck this man, I'm out of his bitch! She has to focus on fixing the mirror realm. Oh, obviously. Because, you know, the plague is still going bug. on. Yeah. yeah. Anyway. I've seen the Dash the hole in the wall that showed the, uh, basically the apocalypse. I think I can see what's going to happen. Maybe. Maybe not. I'm going to cause more chaos. Oh, please. Welcome to the end of stream. Good night.